Hey everyone and welcome back to Immortals Phoenix Rising. On this video, we're doing the quest, My Heavens. That is right here, you can see it has two locations. To help patch the skies, a piece of heaven had to be found. Or was it the sky? Our objective is to locate the fallen pieces of heaven, and there are two of them. So, we're gonna head over to this objective first, we're gonna do the activities on the way, then I'm gonna loop around and do these things, and then head up that way. So that is the plan. Alright, so we wanna go over to this side, and I think the closest thing was a chest right down there. Uh, or maybe the Girong. let's see, that's 352, that's 359, they're about the same. So I guess I'll get the Zhirong first. Nah, let's get the chest first. If these pieces the of the heavenly kingdom don't work, I'll come back with another solution. Yeah, it should be just about below me. That looks about right. Goddess, I heard you created humans by dipping a rope in wet clay and swinging it around real fast. The droplets turn into us. Pay no attention to these unfounded rumors. I crafted each of you by hand. That sounds like it was a lot of hard work. No, Ku. It was a joy. You and your kind, you were worth it. All right, well... I guess we'll get one of the Gorgon dudes first. So take that. Interrupted him. Up we go. Hey, one stun. There we go. Right, there we go. That was a good hit. I got some good use out of that axe. There right, go, they're gone. Finish him off. Good, this guy's stunned. He's screwed though because as soon as he becomes unstunned, I'm just gonna restun him. Like so. Alright, that was easy. Let me grab these peaches and we got a chest. Okay, I said I'd get that G wrong next, so let's do that. Let's see, it's right up there above the waterfall. Got some Girong. And let's see, we got that uh, Griffin esque enemy and some Gorgons. We discovered the Silent Marsh. Alright, we're gonna focus on. Oh, I was gonna go invisible, but it was a little slow on the trigger. Right, focusing on the Gorgons. Right, got them close together, hi! Oh, something hit me. I wasn't paying attention. Watch out, he's gonna shoot. Tornado. Take like this! Hopefully get him stunned here. Not quite. Oh, God. Oh, what? I parried that. I don't know what's going on. I don't know how that missed. I just healed myself with some uh, peaches. Send in the bird! That bird ain't doing anything. Understand? Take Alright, I got beat up a little bit, but we got plenty of healing items and. Stamina orbs, collect stamina orbs to regain some stamina instantly. Collect them while using skills and godly powers to extend their duration and use them more often. That is the plan. 
Fire arrows, shoot arrows through a flame to ignite them and light other braziers. For better control, use Yi's arrows. So. Oh, and corruption. Corruption can block paths or prevent things from working properly. Destroy it with a melee attack. I'm trying. As that gives us a block. We'll deal with that block in a bit. Let's first go in here. Actually, no, I need that block now, don't I? All right, we're taking the block. We're gonna stand here, we're gonna throw it there. It drops below. Then we can pick it up and drag it over here. And that lowers the barrier. All right, we got one of these. This one's a little bit trickier. I'm not very good at these puzzles, so I don't have a great uh, piece of advice on how to do this. But we'll see what I can do. So I'm going to start by shooting the center. Oh, actually, that's super easy. All right. Apparently, I had an easy solution, and I didn't even realize it. Just do that. All right, we're up to one jade coin. Floods hit this place hard, but... The flooding was eventually stopped by piles of burnt reed ash. Not one of the more exciting myths, I guess. Here's a tale of rival swordsmen who dueled to the death. And here's the time we burned up some reeds. All right, that gives you a hint. Look where the fire is. And use that for this puzzle. So, we shoot that one. We shoot that one. And we shoot that one. Oh, I actually hit it. Shoot that. And there we go. New weapon, the Axe of Nuwa. Let's check it out. Plus 40% stun with Axe Cleave, not bad. And rank 4, plus 55% damage for 6 seconds after a perfect parry. All right, we are now close to our objective. It's just up the hill. Let's go. All right, got some enemies. Found you. It's telling me about Nuwa's agility for some reason. I don't quite know why, but hey, whatever. Oh my uh, god, the power took a little bit to activate there and I got hit. That's rude. Alright, send in the bird. I do have some stamina orbs lying around. Might have to take advantage of that. I don't know how he ended up over there. Alright, stuck. Alright, big guy is stunned? No, not stunned. Not sure why, but I'll just stun him. Stun him myself, I don't need help. Oh, I missed. That was dumb. Be able to finish him easy here. They heal up. I'm missing the health. At least most of it. Dang it. That sucks. Oh, wow. I just killed him. Alright, so right over here, there's a shiny on the ground. This piece of heaven is pretty dirty. And these monsters seem to be attracted to it. Ah, we got a piece of heaven. Uh, you can see there's a yellow crystal up there. We should probably go grab that now. May as well get bow and potion pouch upgrades. Doubt I'll need them, but I still want them. Alright, so where are we going next? 
We could get that G wrong next. Let me check my map. Make sure that makes sense. Yeah. Yeah, we'll do that next. The world shell. All right, so big turtle shell. I thought turtles live forever, but this one looks pretty dead. Goddess, do you know what happened to it? Well, I'm sure whoever killed it to use its legs and prop up the world had their reasons, but no. I have to go now. Oh. She's guilty. <gasps> okay, we've got Giron. Back up to three. Let's go inside and say hello to the enemies. Hi. I could have stealth attacked, but whatever. Take that, Perry. Right, I'll switch focus to him. Or not. Oh god, all three, I think. Or did I miss him? Use the bird! Oh! Hello! I didn't know you joined the fun. Stun for you! Oh wow, he's got a lot of health. Alright, he's gonna take some work. Oh god! He didn't like that. Oh, he got me. Wow, this guy hurts. Trying to get him stunned. Oh my god. All right, healing potion. I need to stop underestimating him. Oh my god, where does this guy come from? He's misplaced. He should not be here. I'm not ready for something this difficult yet. I am barely scratching it. I guess I should have used the attack potion, but oh well. A little late now. Eat bird! And he's dead. Bagua Myth Challenge. Place orbs in a specific layout to match the hexagram pattern. All right, so this orb's in the wrong spot. We shall put it here. Right, and let's go up here. Okay, we got a block. Pop that down. And we got an orb there, I'm gonna bring it down. And then over here, into the slot. Just being a little stubborn. Hey. Come on. In you go. Oh my god. Really? Come on. In. Alright, I have not had this issue before. There it goes. Alright, so now we go over here. And we drag this over onto that pressure plate. And then we can pull. Oh, wait. Crap. I don't want to do that. Put that back in there. I want to grab the top one. There we go. And drag that down. Oh, nope, 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 no. That one right there. Oh, my God. All right. I guess I come over here. Drag it this way. All right. And then through. Cool. Let's throw that down. I'll go place it later. Actually, I put it right in the slot, so that works. Same thing here, drag this all the way over, and through. All right, good. We'll put that right there. Perfect. 
Alright, next we go up here. I'm actually gonna need this block, I believe, so I'm gonna take this with me. Oh, actually, I don't need this block. Alright, never mind. What I need is to light this, and I will do that right here. Alright, stand here, dash inside. Oop, didn't quite make it. Get a little bit closer, and dash inside. Alright, easy, we're gonna take this down here. Plop that down. I actually need another orb, so I'll grab that. Place that there, that opens up the gate. And then I go up here. Hit that to make it smaller. Drop it down. And then hit it to make it big. That gives me access to the orb. Which I can't seem to get. There we go. Alright, and then there's one more orb inside. We don't have to do anything special for that. Just go grab it. So put that there. Put that there. Grab that. Drop it here. That orb. Put it here. And the final one inside right here. Alright, three jade coins. Not bad. This hexagram, the owl tortoise, represents the earth. Earth? But the owl comes from the sea. Are you sure, goddess? The owl swims in the ocean, but tends to its young on land. It uses the elements as they are meant to be used. Unless you mean to tell me you bathe in dirt? Alright, let's go this way. So you can see we have a chest and Jirong coming up. Guess we'll get the chest first. Looks like there's some harpy dudes in the way. We could do a stealth attack, I suppose. Take this! That's pretty good. Let's get the harpy next. Ah, oh, missed. I overestimated its range. Like this. Shield guys down, the big guy should be stunned, and then I can easily finish. Maximum power. Oh, I am barely scratching. Him. Look at that health, that's crazy. be able to finish him here. Right, that was good. Chest over here. Right, five peaches. Not the most exciting find. And four peaches right there. So the peaches just lying around were almost as good as the chest. Girong. <laughs> Back up to four, and we're gonna go out to that island. So you can see there's two harpies and two cyclops dudes. So it's gonna take some work. 
gonna take some work. I could use an attack potion. We'll see. I may or may not use it. Depends on how things are going. Invisible. Ah, screw the invisibility. Harpies first. Wow. Instantly took him down. Alright. I gotta be careful. They're probably gonna try to throw rocks at me. I throw a rock at you. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, that barely hurt him at all. Alright, he's got some serious health. So let's use the attack potion after all. Come here, Harpy. Right, almost got this one stunned. Come on, stun already. What the heck, I thought it was almost stun. There you go, watch out for that rock. Even with the power potion, he is barely dying. Oh, I tried to use my uh, godly power, didn't work for some reason, using the health potion. There we go, almost got him stunned. Alright, should be able to finish him before he recovers. Eventually, he will die. Oh, maybe not. I'm gonna take this. All right, a little tough, but we made it. New weapon, the Sword of Nuwa. Hope it's good. Uh, refills 150% of a health chunk on a perfect dodge, all right. And rank four, melee weapons have an 8% chance to strike two nearby enemies with lightning on hit. And it's green, I like that. All right. Let me up up the map, see where we're going next. So we did all that stuff, that's good. Uh, so yeah, we're going over there. We may as well fast travel. So we'll fast travel back to the Silent Marsh. That got us much closer, 420 meters away. Got some enemies in the way. Do I need to mess with them? Oh, I've already done that. Okay, avoid them. No need to do that a second time. Coop, did you know your parents? I have faint recollection of them, but that was a long time ago, relatively speaking. Oh, I see. I learned to not take crap from anyone. Human or God? Uh, I mean, humans. <laughs> and so that's our target. Where all those harpy dudes are at. Oh, we got a blue crystal over there. We've also got a chest. So I'll do this. I'll get the blue crystal and then I'll go do the chest. And then we'll go from there. There's also some Jirong nearby. All right, Harpies. You and me. Oh, I got it. These godly powers seem to be activating just a little slow. I don't know what's up with that. It's gotten me hit a few times now. Ah, oh, dang it. See, like, right there. I was trying to activate it earlier, but he insisted on finishing his combo. Quite sure what happened to the other harpy. Guess I killed it. Goddess Nuwa? 
I found a piece of heaven. But it's covered in stuff. It's corrupted. There must be some that remain untainted. Alright, we got both. Peng Lai used to be the land of rainbows, right? Maybe those dragons to the east. Child, don't even think of going there. No dragons! Find me more pieces of heaven and hurry back. Okay, okay. Right after I see about a dragon. Yeah. Alright, investigate the sky dragon's grave that way. Uh, let's first go do this uh, puzzle. And like I said, get the boost. May as well get this saffron. And whatever this is again. Chrysanthemum, that's right. Alright, so for this one, what you need to do is drag this over. And then shoot it so it gets big. Oh, we need to position that a little bit better. Right there should work. So block the laser so you can go in here and drop the barrier. That also uh, drops the laser beams. Uh, so, shoot that, make it small again. And drag it over here. And then shoot it to make it big and activate that. And that turns on the wind right here. So what I want to do is aim that towards there. That's going to drop that and get the wind activated over here. Now I'm going to turn this that way. It's obviously getting blocked by the cube. Then that'll go that way, that'll go that way, and activate that. So that's what I want. Um, what we're going to do now is make that small. The wind will come through. We need to be quick because it's not going to stay active for long. Basically what it does is it activates here, drops that, and then has the wind come through, but it only goes for so long. Hopefully that was clear. New weapon, the bow of Nuwa. Uh, 30% chance to refill three arrows on headshot. I don't really care about that, to be honest. And rank four plus 30% damage with first three arrows. That one's much better. But either way, we'll use it. It's cool looking. Alright. I think the Girong will be next. If I'm not mistaken. Yeah, I think so. Let me open up the map. Yep. Okay. So, Girong right there. Everything I've heard about dragons says the elements are at their command. I also heard they're kind of freeloaders. Weird. Yeah. Alright. Back up to five, Girong. We got some enemies up ahead. I think a stealth attack is in order. Although this is burning through my stamina. Didn't mean to stealth for that long, but oh well. Oh my god, once again, I was trying to use the godly power. And uh, it just has the delay that Phoenix didn't have. I don't like it. We should be able to fire off those godly powers instantly. Whatever. We'll, uh, we'll adjust. Alright, we'll send in the bird. Alright, stun both of them. Got the parry on him. Alright, so I didn't stun both of them. He's not stunned yet, but now he is. Now he is. Maybe. Now he is. There we go. Oh, that took him out. Alright, I really hate this puzzle over here. Uh, let's see. I think we need to remove or destroy the uh, pots. They're gonna get in the way. So, anyways, we got a uh, wind over there. Um, I think there's some peaches back here. Yeah. 
Got this peaches. Um, and I'll actually use one of them. Uh, so this lowers the middle one. Is that what I wanted? Yeah, I think I want to lower that all the way down. And then this raises the middle one, but lowers the outer two, I believe. Actually, let me uh, look here again. Let's see. Yeah, I think I bring that all the way down. And then I bring these up. But yeah, it's not quite right. Maybe I'm doing this backwards. Maybe I bring this one all the way down. And then balance it this way. Nope, that's still not right. Yeah, this is why I hate this puzzle. I, I don't quite know how to do it right. But yeah. You're trying to get them all so the thing just barely gets over the top. Yeah, alright, hold on. Let me raise that up that maybe but that's where I started yeah not quite there Ugh. yeah I don't have any great advice for this puzzle I really hate this one I had figured it out eventually but I'm obviously having issue replicating that oh you know what I think I do I think this is what I do. I think I raise this up to right there, to the right one's topmost point, and then I drop it down again. No, that wouldn't make any sense. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, I think I think what we need to do, drop these all the way, raise this a little bit higher. All right, that will probably be good, then lower. All right, we're getting close now. We're getting close. Oh, it's just slightly off. All right, I need that one to be slightly higher and that one to be slightly lower. So let's see if we can do that. So go to the top. Actually, oh, I think I want them to be about equal. Yeah, so a little bit more. Yeah, yeah, all right. I think that'll be good. And then we swap positions, bring them all down equally. That's the trick. All right, there we go. That's the trick. I think I, yeah, all right, still working. All right, cool. So yeah, to recap, get the far right one and the far left one equal and then just bring everything down. Much easier than I was making it. I right, got two health potions and five peaches. Discovered Sky Dragon's Grave. Enough to kill something this big. Maybe the goddess was right about this place. Seems like there's nothing here but death. All right, so what we need to do is get a big Whoa, block right here. Key, come back, help! What in the? Who are you? Why do you need my help? Well, kid, as a great philosopher once said, I'm stuck. Help me out of this beautifully shaped skull. Okay. Got a voice talking to me. So, anyways, what we need to do is get a big block right here. So we're gonna head inside. We're gonna take these blocks over here on the left. And throw them up there. Apparently it wants me to use the clone, but that's actually not necessary. So I'm not sure why it's telling me that. Anyways, stack both of these on top. Good, that gives us access to the morph, uh, morph cube. We'll bring that out. Now, we wanna bring these blocks back down because we are now stuck inside. We need to get them back to where they were in order to escape. So, right there. Cool, bring this out. Drop it down and hit it. Okay, that activates that brazier. Then we simply stand over here, shoot through the fire, and destroy the sea.
Marshal. I'm free. That skull smells like a snake's armpit, man. Thanks a bunch, kid. Hong's the name. Always smart to get on a dragon's good side. You're... a dragon? Obviously. I may not be all in <clears throat> one piece, but I had the power to make your semi-wildest dreams come true. If you're really who you say you are, then you can help me restore the balance to this land. Whoa, whoa. Remember I said semi-wildest. What about a rainbow? Can you give me that? Kid, just so happens that rainbows are my specialty. We dragons kind of own when it comes to the elements and all that. Uh, awesome. But I'm guessing it's not that simple. First things first. I need to be reunited with my little sis, Ni. She completes me. Literally. If you can help a dragon out, we'll get you what you need. The purest form of the heavens. Surely this will be an even bigger help to the goddess. Fine, but you better make good on those promises. You got it. Mind if I hit you right? Oh man, that doesn't feel too good. All right, we got a little dragon soul dude, Hong. He's in our quest bag. The soul of a once powerful dragon, or so he claims. Also, he talks a lot. All right, cool. We've got some Jirong right over here. All right, we're up to six now. All right, so we need to locate Hong's sister. She's up that way. And this Sky Chaser challenge will get us part of the way there. Let's go. Oh, I outran it. Well, it's going this way. It's too slow for me. Oh, it failed. Oh, apparently I have... Well, that's stupid. I can't outrun it. But if he's slow, that's his fault. Okay, apparently I gotta go slower. Well, at least I got some peaches. Okay. Make sure the slow bird doesn't get too far behind or behind at all. Alright, slowly flying through here. Come on, slow bird. Okay, here we are. Got two jade coins. We're up to six. Looks like the corruption stretches pretty far back. Got some enemies. Hi, guys. They just have too much health. Too much health. Oh, okay. Let go. Alright, get down. Yeah, whatever. We'll fight him up here. There we go. Got rid of him. Oh crap! Oh, I was gonna throw the rock. Take that! Dang it! All right. Hit you. Finished off the shield guy. Oh, took a hit there. Dead. Nice. 
All right. What do we do here again? I just use this flame, right? Yep. That's perfect, kid. Okay, we're getting there. All right, looks like I found the sister. Wait, so this is your twin? That means two-headed dragon. I knew it. I'm on the right path. Okay, we've got a puzzle here. Being a dragon must rule. I mean, how did you use all that power? We used our weather powers mostly to mess up people's picnics. That's it? The looks on their faces were good, Jade. Alright, so we need to shoot that cube. That'll drop the barrier here. We want to point this to the right. We want to point this out that way. And let's see, we go back outside, we shoot the cube again, and the wind will go through and out. Oh, right, and we need to unlock the seeds, so stand up here after I grab these peaches. Stand right here, take a shot, slow it way down so you can make the turn, and light it. Human. Hello, Ni. I'm Ku. The boring old human that freed you. And your brother. This thing. Um, so about that rainbow. You heard of Blade Nice neighborhood, affordable prices, amazing storms. Sis and I need to energize a bit. And that's the perfect place. <laughs> Home of the dragons? I've always wanted to visit. Uh, let's go right. Oh, wait. Hold on. Where are you? Is everything okay? Are you all right? What's taking you so long? Goddess Nua, I have something great to share with you. I may have a lead on the element of heaven. Oh, okay. Wonderful. Hurry back. Nua? Oh, crap. All right, we got knee. The soul of Hong's little sister who forms the other half of a two-headed dragon. Trust us, it makes sense. Of course it does. All right, before we leave, we need to pick up the Jirong at the top of that sword that impaled poor knee in the head. But who knows, maybe she deserved it. Hey, no, don't you fall. I'm going to the top. Yeah. Alright, we're up to seven Jirong. Okay, let's go this way. You can see there's a blue crystal up ahead. We'll get that next. Uh, 192 fragments. That's a strange number. Feels like it should have been 200. Anyways, we've got a guarded chest over here. God is. I've been wondering. Did you know what humans would be like before you created them? No. Each creature I made had their own personality, beyond my control. I had some successes, like dogs, for example. Any duds? Oh, uh, the cockroach. Even now, I have no idea what I was thinking with that one. 
All right, we got that griffin thing up top, and we got the, we'll call them regular enemies down here. We're gonna focus on them. I'm gonna do a stealth attack on this shield guy before I run out of stamina. Take this! Watch out! Did that hit? Oh, look at them. Alright, send the bird in. They're all grouped up. Oh, he got me with his charge. Oh, he even got the griffin with that. Nice. Alright, that's gonna help a lot. Let me finish off this one. The griffin's almost done. Ah, oh, crap. Ow, that hurt. Right, healing up with the potion. Going up to the griffin. He's done. He's done. <laughs> New visual Taiyi Sharpen Jean. Once used to gently strike bells, this sword now strikes enemies. Not quite as gently, but the ringing sounds are still nice. Alright. So you can see some uh, Jirong up there. That's our next target. Kid, did I hear you correctly? You're taking us to Newark? The Newark? Yeah, so? I don't know why, but the sound of her name just makes my ethereal form feel all sorts of tingly. And not in a good way. Huh. Alright, next. Legend says that Master Fushi wooed the goddess by throwing a giant millstone from the mountaintop, which won her over. Kind of a weird dating strategy. But I'm single, so what do I know? <gasps> All right, Giro. Back up to eight. Gonna have a lot of health. All right, over here we got some enemies. Get my stamina back. This is Fuji's millstone. Stealth attack. Double stun there. That was nice. Send in the bird. Oh, he got me. What? Very missed somehow. Right, finish him. Oh, okay, miss him. That's cool too. Finish him. Parry. Axe strike. And got the guy. All right, all clear. All right, so we got one of these bell challenges. What we need to do is go over here. Oop. Uh, oh, actually, I did want to go down here. All right. So go down here, get right up against this barrier, and shoot the target. Um, shoot the target. There we go, and the barrier switch, so we want to go to the end. And now we're going to shoot up through the ceiling, and then down, and hit the target again. The barrier switch, and now we have access to this cube. Get out. So, take this over here. Plop it down. 
and hit it. And that'll activate that bell up top. So that's the first bell that we need to strike. So strike that. Then this one. Now we run over here. Stand on this pressure pad. Shoot through. That's the third one, and the fourth one's over here. Same deal. Alright, there we go. I'll grab these peaches. Got some saffron. Hey, pick it up. Pick it up. There we go. Alright, got a jade coin. Okay, so we need to report back to Nua with our discovery. So if we look at the map, you can see pretty much everything over here has been done. With one exception, there was a chest that I missed back here near the uh, Unity Shrine. So we're going to go back there really quick, get that chest, and then we'll head back to the Peace Forge. All right, so the chest that we're looking for is actually below us. Apparently, I never revealed it, but it's right down here. So, we need to uh, pull the lever. Stand on the pad. Shoot the targets. Oops. Get through. Same deal. Oh, crap. Oh, why is it hitting the... Oh, it's hitting the bars! What the heck? I clearly was not aiming at the bars, but it hit them anyway. I'm not quite sure what happened there, but anyways, do it again. Very clearly not hitting the bars, okay. There we go. Alright, we got five peaches. And that's it. So, let's go ahead and fast travel to the Peace Forge. All right, let's see what upgrades are available. We definitely have Jirong. So we can get one, two, two health upgrades. Okay, how about stamina? Nope, haven't been to any uh, pieces of heaven or whatever they call them. Any heaven places. We do have coins though. We have seven coins. Uh, I mostly use Huang Di, the Blades of Huang Di, so we'll just upgrade that. We can increase stun of each blade summoned by the God Seal of Huang Di to 18. It's currently at Wow. From 4 to 18? Holy crap. All right, that's a huge upgrade. We're getting that. I should have got that first. Well, I guess the damage was good, though. Anyways, we got that upgrade. Okay, at the forge, what can we get done? Well, we can upgrade our axes, get that up to 60 damage, that'll be good. Uh, we can upgrade our bow, get that up to 50 damage. I'm a little shy to get another sword upgrade, so we'll have to wait on that. Uh, as for armor, get our helmets to 20 defense, get our armor to 20 defense. And we can keep going with this. So let's get helmets to 28. And armors to 28 as well. Alright, then we can get some arrow upgrades. 
And potion pouch slots. Alright, that's all of the upgrades I can do for now. Alright, good uh, potions. I'm sure I can craft some. So we get back up to full health potions. Attack potions, we have two now. Stamina potions full, and defense potions can't do anything there. All right. Um, so let's see. I think we're all good now. Yep, that was every type of upgrade. I guess I may as well grab these peaches. They're just lying around. Pick that up. And up here. Goddess, look what I found. What took you so long? Did you find the pieces of heaven? I found something even better. Yeah. Uh, two dragon souls. They can bring us a real rainbow. Dragons? And where are they now? Oh, they can't travel too far, so I left them into my body. Hey, you two, come out. You did what? What else did they promise you? These dragons are dangerous, child. You've seen how the chaos affects anything from heaven. Yes, you're right. I've seen the heaven has fallen to the scar, but the sky still stands. Why is this such a difficult choice for you? Do not talk to me about choice, child. There is so much you do not yet understand. I made many hard choices to protect humankind. Sacrifices had to be made. And everything worked out just fine. No regrets. Regrets? I'd make the same choices again in a heartbeat. Everything I did then and do now is for humankind, for you. And now you're just... Why can't you just be safe and stay put? Goddess, there are plenty of people that are staying put. And it's not by choice. I will recover these dragons' power with or without you. Recover? Wait, you don't know. Come back, child! What are you gonna do, goddess? Lock me up again. I won't get in your way. Do what you think is necessary. All right, with that, our quest is complete. My heavens. We have a new quest, the Sky Dragons. All right, so let's get all caught up. All good here in the uh, inventory. I know there's some new info in the tutorials, so let's go through that. The Mortal Lands, we got the Bagua Myth Challenge. Place orbs in a specific layout to match the hexagram pattern. And apparently that's it. Alrighty. So with that, we're all done here. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.